Today we'll be reacting to Vegan Booty, also known as Tash Peterson. Not only she criticized us as we eat meat and dairy on a daily basis, she also eats plants for the living. So let's search up her name and let's see what she is like in person. Did I spell her name right? Okay, here is her channel, Tash Peterson. So we're just gonna go down and react to uh, this video right here. The screens aren't playing. The sound you hear now. This is public disturbance, y'all. If this happens in any private properties, then kick them out immediately because they're causing a disturbance for others to have a meal in peace. Pigs screaming for their lives inside carbon dioxide gas chambers! They burn from the inside out! You're responsible for their murder if you're not vegan! And their blood is on your hands! He is one of the dumbest vegans out there, of course she is. Want to live? Come on, Come on. Tash has the balls to scream all that shit out to convince to eat plants. And she don't have the balls, she has a vagina, obviously, because she's a girl. To People are faking pretending to be a police officer nowadays. A thing for a, a vegan patron, and she didn't particularly like it very much. I mean, he had a few words to say about this last night. Take a look. I, lo I lost um, my partner because of this. Um, I lost, you know, a relationship that I thought I was going to marry this woman and she just couldn't handle the amount of attention. She's a very private person and, uh, yeah, thanks vegans. And fuck you to um, Tash Peterson for making this guy, John Fountain, miserable. You ruined his fucking life, he lost his partner and he can't 
handle the pain that it's going through. You're barred for life. So he's now been subjected to protests and all sorts of stuff out the front of his restaurant because he's dared to say, I have a steak restaurant. If you're a vegan, maybe don't come to the steak restaurant. And you can see here on the screen some of the attacks that have been going out out the front of his restaurant. It's just insane, these people. They say, OK, well, we're all about uh, the rights of animals and we're peaceful and whatever, but we're more than happy to come and attack a restaurateur who's simply trying to cater to the vast majority of the population. Right, if I was John Mountain, um here right now, I would slam Tash to the ground, like literally. She's an annoying bitch. Yeah, it's unbelievable. And the fact that these people, I mean, how narcissistic, how arrogant, how entitled do you have to be to be like, these are my life choices and now I'm going to make your oh. life hell until you don't eat meat or eggs or cheese either. This is utterly ridiculous. This actually started off as quite a funny story yeah. because this vegan had what she deemed a bad experience, left a terrible Google review and he was basically like F you and everyone thought it was quite funny and he said fine never come back to my restaurant the vegans have taken it now into their own hands to absolutely demonize this guy and the people coming to his restaurant you saw in the footage there they had a loudspeaker just making it a terrible dining experience and now this guy's lost the love of his life single most important thing anyone who lives anywhere near this restaurant if you agree that this bloke's been done over book a table at his restaurant. Fire yeah. is the name of the restaurant. Because here's the thing, what ends up happening is that the pest of power of the left and the relentlessness of people who can hit you from every angle, from everywhere in the country online, yeah. means they can crush you from far away. Mm. If your community supports you, if you support this bloke, he finds a way through. So, yep, it's all of us a unity ticket of what's going on here, but you can do something. Find this thing online, book a table, do it every couple of weeks, keep this bloke's business alive. Oh so, yeah, that is it guys. Please book a restaurant at Fire where John Mountain is cooking up some dish. I highly recommend going to that place, but I don't know the location, but I will definitely put it in the video so yeah please support that guy because he lost the love of his life all thanks to the vegans they were stupid anyways yeah guys you know the drill please I've been waiting to get up to 200 subscribers but I'm still stuck at 106 remember to like comment and subscribe to my channel to see more videos and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.